morning everyone. Just come out on the balcony while the pups are downstairs again. Oh, it's Coda's been down a few times this morning. Oh, we, oh it's chewy back. Anyway, a bit of a slow morning. Didn't wake up to 6.30, so yeah. We're back again, Coda Bear. That's what you want to get out there for. Don't know if he's eating grass or what. But like you've been out twice in the last half an hour. Apparently the door open because it's a bit cool still. <laughs> I think it's only like 9 or 10 degrees. Well, it's 12 degrees now. It has warmed up a little bit this morning. So I didn't end up vlogging yesterday much. I might have done a little bit. I can't remember. Kevin ended up having a sick day, so he was home. He slept for nearly most of the day. It's just to do with his burnout. Uh, so I didn't end up... Well, I did do stuff, but I didn't film it. I'll show you what I did. A bit of food prep, really. I was allergic yesterday. And it's a pretty sounding bird I don't know what that one is but I'm still trying to be careful with my ankle every day gets better but it's still it's not sore when I walk now but standing still on it seems to be the worst last night I didn't want anything touching the ankle it was really weird <laughs> but uh yeah it's getting better slowly 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 anyway Kevin has gone to work today I don't have a lot of food prep to do I just got to cook the black beans that I soaked last night I got the chickpeas done yesterday, so that's I think that's the only food stuff I have to do today. Everything else should be done is done, I believe. So I'll get that done this morning and then get on to cleaning. That will be good. Mm. That's my plan anyway, so it should be fine. Mm. Should be good to get that done. <laughs> at the moment so I was just still watching <laughs> watching a video life at Lisa underneath and then I started just started to look at some of our, our home photos and I don't know if I ever showed you guys these last sort of photos that we've got that show let me move this down a bit I'll make this a bit bigger these are from our apartment they took photos for everyone because of the delay so there is going to be wooden slats along this side so that will block out at least camouflage quite a bit of the view of the oh, a big hotel that's being built across across the wetlands Gee, the wetlands look really muddy must have been a bit of rain so that's sort of one of our views from our balcony i thought i know i've shown you this this is our kitchen under construction so fridge is going in here and then we've got like a very small pantry up that end i'm very glad to see drawers in here because as you know from my last kitchen that I designed myself, I'd much rather draw some cupboards. So that was good. We don't really know what we're getting. <laughs> all we know is the colours and sort of a very rough land layout. We don't know much at all. I don't even know where the microwave's going. And then obviously we've got the window there, which should be nice. And we can sort of see out. And air conditioning. And it looks like there's a cupboard here. And all it says on the plans is open shelving. But it looks like there's going to be... It looks like there's hinges for a door. It should be another little pantry area or big appliances or something. I don't know what I'll use that for, but that's good. That that's going to be doors rather than what well, looks like to doors rather than open shelving. This is the spare bedroom, I think. Um, no, that's our bedroom. That's the hotel. So this is our bedroom. So they've kind of got, like, you sort of see that's the marina out there. And you can see from the standing position, and again, the hotel's kind of, kind of tucked in the back, back there. They've kind of got it set up so the bed would go along this wall. And well, not that we'll have a TV, but if you had a TV, it'd be on this wall. But 
I'm kind of thinking if it went face the other way, yes, you'd have to walk around the bed, which would be a bit of a pain, but from bed, you would have a view. So we don't know about that yet, we'll see, because obviously it's set up for that side. So we'll probably put it in that side and then we'll see. I mean, I don't really sleep in bed anyway, but still, and Kevin would end up with the good side, not me. <laughs> so we'll see about that. Um, that's another one of our room, our bedroom. This is Kevin's study. So he just has the, it is officially a bedroom. It's got the one little window there and a half wardrobe on that wall. And this is the, this is, this is Kevin's study still. You can see his wardrobe space there. Oh, not on a touch screen. And we're back in our kitchen. Well, there'll still be a lounge room. <laughs> It's got stuff there's no like that's just uh that's probably the pantry cupboard bits of the kitchen in it at the moment this wall over here is angled and that's again that's the view from our balcony water marina again though there is going to be wooden sets along here so i said it depends how they suit, suit, put them in i guess how it's going to turn out i think they're in now a laundry it's just enough for a, a tub a laundry tub and washer and dryer but it's a walk-in room which is good this is the spare bedroom and back into the lounge room again and this is the other it's not really a room because no door on it i think they call it a study I don't know what, quite, what we're going to use it for. I'm kind of thinking like an exercise area. My clothesline might go through there because they can't go on the balconies, but I could put it here and open up the window. <laughs> open up the door, which goes that way. I don't know. And there's all shelving on this wall behind here, open shelving that we can't see. That's um, one of the bathrooms. Not sure which one. <laughs> And that's the spare bedroom again. So that's it. So yeah, you go a little peek of some of the rooms of our house. This was these were taken um, middle of June, I think. We were over in Alaska at the time when these came through. It's um, exciting to see a bit of their construction. As I said, I'm not feeling the best. I've got a bit of a headache, and I don't know, just got a bit of a lack of energy today. Got the dogs there walk, so that was really good, and. I haven't, like nothing's essential, it's cleaning the house. I've cooked the black beans, I do need to put them into Sasha bags to pop them in the freezer. But other than that, there's nothing particular to be, nothing that's critical to be done today. But I do want to make a start on the cleaning. Even if it takes me over the weekend, I want to get a start done. Uh, I did whip the vacuum round. I don't know which day I kind of filmed it or not. So I have vacuumed the kitchen and the lounge area. I haven't done the bedroom and that. Again, that's so quick and easy. So I'm not sure where I'll start. At the moment, I'm just having another cup of tea. I did have um, some chia pudding for breakfast earlier. So just see how this headache goes, I guess, if I need to take something for it or whatnot. Um, yeah, I will get some stuff done, I'm sure. So this headache goes and I'm gonna watch, so I'm gonna finish watching Lisa's video, the cleaning one. So I need some cleaning motivation. And then we'll get to that. Did finish my jigsaw puzzle yesterday too, so I need to remember to show you guys that puzzle, that Halloween one. <laughs> that was very nice. Yeah. Anyway, we'll see how we how we get on. The dogs are just doing their breakfast, and I've just refilled, or just filled up the little um the dog treat jar. I used to keep this where their um, leads were because we needed to sort of um, encourage them with the leads, which are the halties they don't like them so much with fluffy fluffy faces. Uh, but I have my little one walking treats there I can use. I used them this morning actually, but they'll mainly to give to the dog walkers to get them to come up the drive, the, the, got the ramp with them. But yesterday, was it yesterday? Yeah, when Pauline came yesterday, they were keen to go because they hadn't been on a walk the day before and they were, they were and the day before, Monday and Wednesday, so they've been keen to go on their walks because, yeah, they've obviously gotten used to her now, feel comfortable with her. And when on Monday in particular, they were so excited to go because I hadn't been all weekend out of the house. But now at least I'm walking them, 
Give them little sniff walks on the days that I get their other walk. At least until my ankle is all better and I can resume some proper walks again. <laughs> Let's hope this headache goes away. If it doesn't, it doesn't, and then we'll just um, deal with it. Okay, I am still having trouble getting myself motivated. Don't feel great, so obviously that does not help. Headache hasn't gotten any worse, so, but I'll sit on the toilet. <laughs> Not an essential part of this story. Anyway, I just suddenly realised, why don't I just... I've got to make the bed. Well, it's half made, but I've got to make up the bed, tidy it up. Why don't I just do this room? Because it's such a small room, there's not much to it, and get that done. Isn't that what they call... Something to do with an elephant? Take a first bite. How do you eat an elephant? Take the first bite of an elephant? Oh, I don't know. Anyway, do like a simple, easy task first. And see, my ankle is still bothering me. So... <laughs> Oh, yes that's a good one to do because I've got the bed to do I've got a bit of laundry from yesterday to put away I can dust the two shell the bedside tables mine's tidy Kevin's not so much but I'll um I just put this duster in so I can dust around the stuff and then a quick vacuum because not much floor space and this room will be done not perfect I won't have done the windows I won't have done the mirror but it'll basically it'll look a lot tidier and it'll be basically clean so I'm gonna do that because it's it's not going to take me long, but yeah, this ankle is going to be a problem. But I'll get that done. That'll be okay. And then I'll give him another cup of tea and sit and have a rest. <laughs> I'm drinking so much tea at the moment when it's cold. Once it goes to summer, I switch more to water. Like I'll have tea in the morning and then I'll switch over to water when it's warm. But in the winter, tea it is all day long and evening. Or why Dobby's not been vacuuming? We do not know what's wrong with him. He keeps saying he's running out of his um bags. His bags full. It's supposed to self-empty. Kevin's bought. He bought new bags. That I don't think were quite the right ones. I'm just a bit cheaper, and they didn't work. So had the same problem. So he bought the proper ones that are supposed to be for that vacuum. Still not working. So I'll have to ask him again what he's going to do. Whether it's can send it back. I don't know whether we can send it back. I think he got it on Amazon, so maybe you can go back. I don't know. It's not working anyway, which is a bit of a pain because I do like old Dobby to <laughs> get around and do a bit of a vacuum for us. But anyway, that's half of it done. I've just got to do my. Um, <laughs> thank you, Chewy. I've just got to do. Oh, you nearly on my use. You, that's your daddy, don't you? Yeah, I've just got to um, vacuum, vacuum, dust my bedside table, which is very easy because it's tidy. And vacuum down there when this room's done. Okay, not perfect, but pretty decent. It looks like it's been cleaned anyway. <laughs> well, it has been cleaned. All right, Chewie's pushing me over. Chewie, you're going to have to get up before I can get up. No, you're going down. Okay, all right. I just filmed some stuff for you. I don't know what I filmed, so I won't worry about it. I'm sure it was not at all important. I think I showed you the bedroom. Finished, might not have. And I just mentioned I'm going to leave the duster over in that little table because... I think I'll do that table and, and the table and dust in here and in the front entry of the bookshelf or storage cupboard 
Just do that little bit of dusting. I, don't, I know I need to use Co on where I put my tea because I don't have a little coaster for it. I've only got one coaster here, the rest are in storage. So I'm using it on her furniture to <laughs> keep that in good condition. I think Co should just clean it up a little bit. Just, you know, occasionally the tea gets spilt over there. Um, right, I'm gonna do my black beans, make a cup of tea, sit back down. And yeah, and then I'll, what time are we? One. I'll try and do something else before I, I don't know when I'm going to have lunch yet. Try and, have some, try and do a little bit more work. But so the ankle is bothering me when I'm standing on it. Like, it's bothering me. So I don't want to do too much of that. <laughs> but we'll, get a, we'll try and get another, at least another one or two jobs done. And then tomorrow I can do some more. It might take me, for, like I might not do the shower for a while yet because that's a harder job standing on my feet. Or maybe I can ask Kevin to do it over the weekend. We'll see. We'll just um, continue working away at things and eventually will get done. just had lunch instead of having a tea but I'm gonna have a tea anyway. I'm gonna try and fit it where I'm gonna put all these black beans in the freezer because the freezer's a little bit full even though I've got that extra freezer. I'm not sure if I'm hungry or not but I thought I'd better have some lunch. I thought I was hungry and then I wasn't hungry probably because I had that cup of tea. But anyway I'm just heating up or defrosting some brown rice that I've cooked. Got some tofu, some vegetables, herbal cabbage. I might make up a little tahini dressing when I usually have my salad. I think that'll work. I may just put some, um, hmm, I don't know. <laughs> It'll probably need something. I might not need anything, mind you. Everything's pretty tasty, I'm not saying. I may I'll just try it by itself and see if I need anything. That's a good idea, isn't it? And if I need to make up something, I can make up something. Uh, I'm going to see that cycle. I think it's, so there's 20 degrees, and I think it's quite warm. I've actually opened up the door, which the doggies do like when I do that. And obviously there's no flies at the moment, so that's possible. And then, yeah, I'll see how I go. Obviously, it's late in the day. I'm not motivated to clean. He might have to wait till tomorrow. I did something. Hmm. And it's one of those days. It's been one of those weeks, I think. But I was um, finishing up a video. I uploaded it to YouTube. Had it all ready to go. And then I realized I hadn't done the last one. It's edited. I've shared it. Um, but I haven't put it up on YouTube. So I did that. So I'm now doing that one. When I come back in, I can put that one up today and I'll keep the other one for tomorrow. And then I can go to work on another video. I'm trying to just get them out. <laughs> Still doing the same, two Alaska, one home, but I feel like I'm getting behind on everything at the moment. And yeah, I'm getting up one most days, just not every day. Anyway, we'll get there. One day I'll be back on track. And then it'll probably time to go to the States and the whole thing will start all over again. Hmm. No, I will try and do some more work this afternoon, but I don't know. It is what it is, isn't it? Oh, I was trying to make a list of things to do, and now I remembered what it was. I was looking at the chair going, there's something on that chair, and it's the bath mat that's a bit mouldy on one side. Oh, I don't think I've got any bleach here, though. Do I? No. Any guesses where the bleach is? Where my bleach is? Well, I don't have anything here. Hmm. I'll put it through the washing machine. It's just still got a bit of mold on it, so I don't know what to do with it. I'll have a think about that one, I guess, or maybe do a bit of Googling. It's definitely quite nice out here. I was a bit, <laughs> probably the sun's already there, so I've just sat over here on this little table, which I still haven't cleaned. 
don't really want anything on my lap anyway. <laughs> so I'll have this. Enjoy the nice view. So it's supposed to cool down again, so I want to take advantage. And the puppies like being out here. Kind of over there, so we can. I guess there's yards to patrol over that way. You might see a person. <laughs> Oh, wish I felt better and could have got more done today, but you know, life with fibro, you just have to go with the flow. Anyway, I'm going to eat this, do a bit of Disney planning, and then I'll head back inside and I'll try and do that bit of dusting that I wanted to do. I'll try and get that ticked off the list and then I can at least get started. I think it'll be easier to do more tomorrow if I get started. If I get a bit further today. Well, as hoped i don't know i promise but as hoped or planned for i did do the tables here the two little tables and i also did the little dusting in the front entry and i put the duster into the study next because i'll do that not today then went down and picked up after the dogs and now i'm feeling really yucky again and my ankle's better but it's still still hard on uneven ground and coming up and down the stairs it's just it's now a bit sore my ankle and I've got a headache. I already had a bit of a headache, but I'm feeling worse. So I'm going to go sit down, work on some videos. I don't know if I'll get any more done today. <laughs> we'll see. Actually, before I sit down, I'm going to show you my jigsaw and show you a new bag that I got when I ordered the other day. So this is my new bag. It came in that really pretty case. Case in that pretty bag. But the brand is radical, yes. Not that designed in space made on earth. So I do need to go through this bag. It's quite sitting here because I think I'm carrying a bit too much around on a daily basis. So I want to see what I can take out of there because some's probably only need when we travel. Uh, I just want to move this from bag to bag pretty much. And I've got my wallet and my phone and a little emergency grocery bag. Oh, my, oh, my phone would be in there and got sunglasses. Other extra things in there. I, it's a bit smaller than I thought it was going to be, but I still really like it and I think it's fine. It's padded, which is a bit unusual. I'm not quite sure <laughs> why it's padded, but anyway. I do like it, and obviously it would go much better with winter things, but I need to either get like maybe one or two smaller pouches would probably work well. And I can leave it in the front entry and just swap them and grab what I need. Oh, what's that? This thing has this little sachet thing, isn't it? A little oh, plenty of little silica bags in there. Oh, my ankle's sore, I need to get off it. I, think, uh, I was just gonna show you my jigsaw as well. The dust I'm going to use. This is the puzzle all finished off. Did enjoy that one. I can hear some little birdies at the window. Uh, yeah, so Halloween a little bit early, but that's okay. <laughs> so he comes back along. I think they do this theory. Is, oh, there's two. It's male and female, probably. I think they do the same as what Fred does and come and see the reflection. And, and they just, I can tell the difference in the little tappy noises they make. <laughs> so cute. Yeah, so the male and the female there. Saying, go away, imposters. 